Um, past two days have been um, absolutely amazing. I think it was uh, appropriate to kind of set the stage with some of the geopolitical issues that companies are dealing with. I think that's important because it gives you an idea of what needs to be solved, the problems that need to be solved. And what Peter laid out was some very challenging supply chain problems that may cap the computing power and the computing ability. If you can't get the raw materials uh, to, uh, to production, it's going to create some challenges no matter uh, you know, how great the software is and how great the, the, the innovations are. So we, we have to keep that in mind. Um, had some great panels, great speakers. Uh, Shelly Palmer yesterday, uh, Gamil, uh, Trevor, Scott, um, uh, Stornetta yesterday discussing the blockchain. I mean, you know, having the inventor of uh, blockchain here. And then, Emily, you were kind of facilitating today. W what did you think? You know, I th the thing that stood out to me was a couple things. Fascinating and frightening, as I mentioned before. Just the possibility is absolutely endless. And the one personal takeaway that I've got is it seems more like we're heading back to our childhood. I've heard so many things about using your imagination. Your creativity is the only thing that's going to limit you. And then an AI petting zoo. I think that one's going to stick with all of us for a little while, for sure. Um, coming from my risk background and trust, I think it's absolutely imperative that we trust but verify and keep that in the forefront of our minds as we all proceed. Yeah, I mean, listening to Krista and Srini this morning talking about how, uh, you know, these, these technologies open up entirely new worlds for, for people that, uh, that, you know, just haven't had that, that kind of access before. Absolutely. And then follow that with Monty and his presentation and trip and what's, up, what's possible and the possible uses of mental health and how that could help you be a better performer as well as just manage your own personal health too. And, you know, we're talking about Gen AI, but lurking in the background is quantum computing, and it's, it's coming, and it's coming very quickly, as Arpana talked about. And uh, we've, got, uh, we've got to manage multiple disruptions at the same time, and this is an exponential pace of change right now. So in the not-so-distant future, quantum computers are going to be coming online, and it's going to be a very different type of computing, which is going to open up new possibilities and uh, beginning to give you tools to solve problems that you didn't even attempt with classical computing. Yeah, I couldn't agree more. And I think we're all personally in a place to reinvent ourselves and learn something new. And that's so fascinating for me because we're all learning together at the same time. Nobody has all of the answers. I heard Shelley last night at cocktails say, we're failing more than we're actually figuring out, but we're going to keep going. And so I think that's just really inspiring to see the collaboration. And, you know, some of the wisdom from Frank Slootman, the CEO of Snowflake, right. uh, discussing. One of the things that stuck away from him is, you know, uh, you know if, you, if you leave a void in leadership, it's going to get filled. Mm -hmm. And, you know, he, he, he constantly makes sure that uh, you've got the right people, the right talent, the right leaders in place uh, that are driving towards the a, a common vision. Yeah, a great discussion there too. Yeah, and then Imad talking about uh, you know generative AI and where stability is going, and Nirav for, uh, with uh, with um, Anthropic. Anthropic, yeah, yeah. and you know just terrific conversations in these areas. And then our great panel uh, with Phil and Todd, and uh, you know discussing. Uh, you know, some of the hype, you know, how, how real is this? What is the adoption like yeah. uh, with AI? So this was just an absolutely amazing uh, couple of days. Yeah, I agree. And I think we've only scratched the surface, and this is the tip of the iceberg. I think our summit title is I think we could, have, we, could have, we could have had this over three days. For but, sure. So thank you all for coming. Thank you, Emily, for, for hosting today. Mm -hmm.